All right, I have been a good little slave. Been a good little slave. I am, uh, there a, there's a bus company in this town. I had no idea that they had a, a bus in this town. Huh. I, uh, I am completely amazed that they have a bus in Owego, New York. This is, uh, this is, anyway, but fuck the bus, public transportation. I have me my private vehicle, and I just got my brand new driver's license. So I'm cut loose for eight more years behind, uh, eight more years behind the wheel of my gas-sucking truck. Hallelujah. So, uh, I've been a very good little slave today in Owego, New York. Uh, I got my enhanced driver's license. Uh, so I have a, they said, you want to get your enhanced driver's license so you can get on an airplane. I, I think New York might be the only state out of 50 states where you can decide. I, I, th I think I remember hearing that 49 of 50 states, the little New World Order chip is required. But uh, I went ahead and signed up for my little New World Order chip. And then uh, they asked me, are you registered to vote? Are you registered to vote? And I and I said no. And they said, well, uh, there is an election. Do you want to register to vote? And and I immediately said no. I have no interest in voting in this election. And I got a very uh, disapproving look from this attractive young lady. And uh, I said, you know what? Fuck it. We're going to. Uh, I am going to register to vote. I, I told her, I said, okay, I am uh, 64 years old and I have a perfect lifetime record. And she, that I want to keep it. She goes, oh, really? I, and I said, I have never voted for a winner in my entire life. Never once. I, 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 well, I haven't voted that many times. As I say, the last time I voted for Jesse Jackson was in the 1988 Democratic primary. And uh, no, I did not vote for Mike Dukakis in his little tank. But, uh, and then of course, I've never voted for president since. And so uh, I, I said, what I'm going to do, I'm changing tactics. I said, I'm going to register to vote. And so I, I'm going to vote for Donald Trump. And she uh, kind of, you know, tried her best to, uh, and uh, she, you know, didn't really say much. I said, because, you know, this way I, uh, I want to guarantee that Donald Trump uh, is going to lose. Uh, so the best way that I can get Donald Trump to lose the election is to uh, is to vote for him. And uh, and I made and I said you do understand that I would just as just as likely uh, vote for Kamala Harris to make sure she loses. And anyway, I don't think she cared to hear my political ideas. You know, guys. Uh, I, I, I wasn't going to join in on the on this RFK thing. Uh, good, good guy, though. I mean, what the fuck? I, I, I have to say, uh, RFK, you know, all, all kidding aside, fuck the dude. Uh, you know, I have lost every shred of respect for that man. And, and I was really thinking of, you know, throwing my vote away on that motherfucker. Uh, as a protest vote, and even when I I read the story uh, about the dead bear cub in Central Park, I, I'm thinking, how the fuck did Robert Kennedy even pull that off? 
how the fuck did, 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 did someone as famous as Robert Kennedy carry a dead bear cub and a rusty old bicycle into into Central Park in, in, in the middle of Manhattan and, and, and pull that stunt? Uh, I mean, what the fuck was that man thinking? Uh, and, and, and I was still uh, g g gonna give the dude some slack and, and uh, say, dude, uh, he had no chance, obviously, of, uh, of getting close uh, to this. But then did you see the photograph? The, the fucking photograph uh, of that dude uh, sitting in the back of his van. I, I mean, you can see this mangled baby bear that, that he just saw get hit by a car. I mean, you can see the wounds on it. And, and, and he's sitting there sticking his finger uh, in, in the mouth of this dead bear cub and, uh, you know, doing this fake grimace uh, like the fucking uh, bear cub was, was biting his finger off. Uh, I mean, the guy is a sick, twisted fuck. Uh, you know, I mean, all joking aside, fuck uh, RFK. So, uh, I, I don't need to vote for RFK to make sure he loses. Uh, that motherfucker. Uh, so my, I'm voting Donald Trump. Hambone Little Tail is going to walk into a voting booth in the state of New York and vote for Donald Trump to be my next president. So we can guarantee, I guess, that Kamala Harris. Uh, it, it's <laughs> oh, we are so fucked, people. We are so fucked. Anyway, uh, I've got to go buy some more French vanilla ice cream for my blackberry cobbler while I still can. My gosh.